Digital projection technology has improved significantly in recent years, but the relationship of cost with respect to the available resolution in projectors is still superlinear. In this paper, we present a method that uses light modulator panels, for example LCD or DMD panels, with n by n pixels to create the perception of a target higher resolution CN by CN image, where C is a small integer. This is achieved by enhancing the resolution at specific regions of interest, like edges, and provides superior quality compared to the standard n by n projector output. We decompose a CN by CN high resolution image to a sparse edge image of a resolution CN by CN and a complementary non-edge image of a resolution n by n. These images are then projected in a time sequential manner at a high frame rate to create an edge enhanced image, an image where the pixel density is not uniform but changes spatially. We observe that this image provides a close perceptual match to the original high resolution image. To create the high resolution edge image, we introduce the concept of optical pixel sharing. In a standard digital projector, a light source illuminates a light modulator panel. The modulated light then passes through an imaging lens and is focused onto the screen. We alter the standard digital projector design to create the edge and non-edge images for a grayscale image. Our method can easily be extended to multiple color channels. In front of the projector lamp, we place two cascaded light modulator panels instead of one. Our optical pixel sharing unit is placed in between the panels. For simplicity, we explain the design using 1D illustrations and for C equals 2. For each pixel of the first light modulator panel, the optical pixel sharing unit creates C squared smallest copies of the pixel, each scaled down in size by a factor C in each dimension. These smaller pixels are focused at different locations on the second light modulator panel without any overlap with the other copies. Each pixel of the second panel will pass or block C squared smaller pixels, which then go through an imaging lens to create the final image. Therefore, each pixel of the first panel controls several non-adjacent small pixels on the second light modulator panel, while the second panel controls several adjacent small pixels of the final image. Using such a shared control, we can create a higher density of pixels at E by lighting A and C in the first panel. However, F and G need to be blocked since they receive copies of A and C. This means we cannot show both E and F at higher resolution simultaneously. We call this a conflict due to sharing of A. Similarly, E and G are in conflict due to the sharing of C. We model these conflicts using a graph and show that the optimal set of edge pixels can be found by computing a weighted maximum independent set in this graph. This helps us to define a criterion for an optimal optical design to minimize such conflict and maximize the visual quality. Interestingly, a simple optical design based on a grid of lenses can satisfy these optimality criteria. Here we show an example of the inputs to the first and second light modulator panels that create the high resolution edge image and the low resolution non-edge image. Together, these two create the edge enhanced image. To evaluate our design in a physical setup, we use an unmodified 3D ready projector with a 120Hz refresh rate. We use this projector to simulate an enhanced resolution projector that uses light modulator panels with half the native resolution of this projector in each direction. We sequentially project the edge and non-edge images to create the edge enhanced image. We also project the true high resolution and a low resolution image. These are then captured with an SLR camera with appropriate exposures for comparison. The comparison of these results shows that our method provides a considerably closer match to the image at the original resolution. The computation of the edge and non-edge images is done in real time using our GPU implementation. Finally, we altered a three-chip LCD projector to create a prototype of a grayscale enhanced resolution projector. In a three-chip projector, the light is divided to three color channels. The light through each optical path passes through a light modulator panel to create the three color channels. 
These are then combined via a biprism to form the final image. We use the panel for the green channel as our first light modulator panel. Then we remove the projector lens and move the panel for the red channel outside the projector in front of the green panel. The blue and red light paths are then blocked and the imaging lens is placed after the second panel. This provides us with the two required cascaded LCD panels. Finally, an optical pixel sharing unit using a lens array is placed in between the first and second LCD panels. For this setup, we performed similar tests to those for the 3D ready projector. This again shows a close match between the images from our method with the images at the original resolution. In summary, we present an enhanced resolution projector that can create the perception of an image of resolution CN by CN using light modulator panels of resolution N by N via a novel optical pixel sharing module. We demonstrate the superior quality of such an enhanced resolution projector, both in simulation and also using a prototype.